Back to quick first uh, 200 metres from Dumoose. She's already up on uh, Anchuk in the lane outside, and Dumoose is leading in the back straight and also going well is Modasanu, a Romania, second from the outside. But Dumoose is really powering on the pressure here. This is exactly what she did in the 400 metres flat in Oslo, then faded a little bit from 300 in, but still got a personal best just outside 51. But certainly Modasanu, the Romanian, is going up very, very strongly indeed. And Demus now will close her down as they come into the straight with 300 metres gone. The tall figure of Angela Modasanu, now Demus has taken over. In lane three, that's uh, Khalees Spencer of Jamaica coming into second place. But Demus now looking for a fast time from lane two, Heshnova of the Czech Republic going strongly. But Demus is coming through to take this very, very comfortably indeed. She wins it. problem with the start and already uh, Kelly Spencer gone up very very quickly indeed ahead of Hedgenova and uh, Malane Walker is right up on Malane Walker now as those two head towards the 200 meter mark and the two Jamaicans about a meter or so ahead of the Czech athlete and right on the inside Ristiana Tracy of Jamaica also going well it looks to me as though uh, Kelly Spencer of Jamaica is really putting the pressure on here. It's Jamaica one and two at the moment with Hesnova of the Czech Republic in third place as they come round the top bend. This is, could be quick as they come to 300 metres. Spencer leads, Walker in second place, Hesna in third place. And this will all depend on the fluidity of the last couple of hurdles uh, for Kelly Spencer. She is absolutely charging down. Look at the clock. It's going to be very, very quick indeed. 51, 52. Oh, it's 52.8. through to take second place rallying well 52 77 it is a meeting record well away they go let's keep an eye on those bright yellow socks Vahon we know likes to go out strongly and he's done a gun done so again today but he was talking in the press conference about whether or not he should change his style and keep something in reserve for later on in the race. We know how strongly Samba finishes, but at the moment, it's Varholm being chased down by McMaster. McMaster's having a first great 200 here, but Varholm, but look at Samba now getting into his stride. Samba is making the ground here with 125 to go. Samba already looking round into the home straight. Remember, he's beaten Varholm. Varholm hit that barrier there badly, and 
and Samba surely is going to take this away. Trapped by McMaster. Samba is going to come away. It's going to be five out of five. 46-98. It's a world lead yet again. Now, second from the top, Barham loves to go on very fast. He commits early, he's so strong. Holmes hit that first barrier hard. Barham closing up on him already, left a picture. Benjamin looking very strong in the headband, nice and smooth. He's long and lean. Little stutter of that barrier from Benjamin was there, halfway down the back straight. As Valholm leads by a couple of strides there, left to picture. Benjamin beginning to close on him now. Good running between them from Curran McMaster, although he's losing ground now. But Benjamin has the advantage of having Valholm in his sights. The Norwegian is tremendously strong. Benjamin's still looking smooth. You feel he's got more to come. He eases up alongside Valholm. Will this be the first loss of the summer for the Norwegian, who works out of the final barrier? Stays clear, wins by half a metre. 46-92. It's the second fastest time in history by Carsten Varholm. Of course, it's yet another European record for the Norwegian. And he was pushed every step of the way down that home straight by Ry Benjamin. breeze on the stadium floor there have been some big readings in the long jump over the last half hour or so but they go through that first barrier okay ball there in the center in the red shorts just gaining ground on Shamir Little Shamir Little's flat speed has improved this year she's gone under 50 seconds on the flat there's Shamir Little with that sort of short pink hair ball up on her shoulder now at 200 and the European the Dutch athlete has really taken it to the rest of this field she's attacked Little here very early on she's gone out hard also going well Rishkova in the long white socks in lane three having a very good run looks a little awkward on that barrier though around the crown of the bend but maybe leading at the moment as the stagger unwinds in her favor she's really gone for it too down the home straight ball first there but Rishkova in lane three is giving her a run for her money and Little is coming back now using that flat speed ball's going to hang on or is she Rishkova going back it's so tight at the line oh my word I think ball still hung on and look at the time 52.38 a new meeting record Explodes out of the blocks for Holm as he always does. Vahound already feeling the pressure from the Norwegian. He's already taken two, three meters out of De Santos. Capello trying to go well in the orange as well. And then a gap to Thomas Barr. But Varholm looks good. He's absolutely flying down the back straight there. Clean hurdling. The crowd, all of them on their feet. Man, women and children. All cheering their hero here, little stutter off that uh, barrier into the home straight. Now it's all about strength, driving those arms, takes it cleanly again. One more hurdle to come. Dos Santos is closing quickly. Varholm knows, striking for home, going for the clock. Varholm's going to take the victory. 46 7 0. He's done it. He's done it. We'll wait for official confirmation.